You are watching CBC News Today. I'm Nancy Wilson. Well, as we told you earlier, trustees on the Toronto District School Board have a controversial issue to deal with today. They'll be voting on whether to establish a so-called Afrocentric school. The people behind the idea say it's a way to stop or slow the high school high dropout rate among black kids. Michael Coteau is vice chair of the school board and joins us now. Last time we talked, which was a couple of months ago, you said you had your reservations about this approach, but that you had an open mind. I gather you've since been persuaded. How so? Well, we've had uh, we've had public consultations. We've had deputations. Um, I've spoken to uh, many people in the community, and um, and I've 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 heard uh, this uh, this group of uh, parents uh, from the Northeast who are very concerned about their children's education. I'm convinced that this is the route that uh, that community should go. So refresh our memory. What were your initial reservations to this approach? Well, I think my reservations were that you know it would be a. Um, you are watching CBC News Today. I'm Nancy Wilson. Well, as we told you earlier, trustees on the Toronto District School Board have a controversial issue to deal with today. They'll be voting on whether to establish a so-called Afrocentric school. The people behind the idea say it's a way to stop or slow the high school high dropout rate among black kids. Michael Coteau is vice chair of the school board and joins us now. Last time we talked, which was a couple of months ago, you said you had your reservations about this approach, but that you had an open mind. I gather you've since been persuaded. How so? Well, we've had uh, we've had public consultations. We've had deputations. Um, I've spoken to uh, many people in the community, and um, and I've 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 heard uh, this uh, this group of uh, parents uh, from the Northeast who are very concerned about their children's education. I'm convinced that this is the route that uh, that community should go. So refresh our memory. What were your initial reservations to this approach? Well, I think my reservations were that you know it would be a um, 